I have encountered a very bizarre glitch. I was doing my own thing, just casually playing Minecraft in my own personal survival world, just, you know, chilling. And I came across some sort of really, and I mean really bizarre glitch. This right here is the Minecraft world that I'm currently playing right now, and there's something weird about this. There is a wee tiny problem with the textures. It doesn't seem to just be any of the textures, it seems to be specifically entities. Because, look at these blocks, this is cobblestone and these acacia doors are completely fine, same with netherrack. But then look at these torches, with the, specifically the particles of the torches, or items, or the shadows, the shadows are different. They're black, they're pure black. This is a diamond sword by the way, and it's not just me as well, like all kinds of mobs, like this is a baby piglin right here. And he is completely, like, he's just complete shadow. Like, bear in mind, this is with Optifine on right now, and I don't understand why this is the case. It just seems to be the way it's, well, happening. And the weirdest thing is as well is that, like, look at this. This portal is completely black. So it goes to this chest as well. I can try open it, and it just doesn't seem to do anything. Now, I don't exactly know what's going to happen if I go back into the overworld, because this is going to cause some maybe make cause problems. I don't exactly know, but I am a bit scared to figure out why this is happening. If you guys have any idea what's happening, let me know in the comments below, because I am completely clueless. I looked up online, and I could not find anything revolving around this in 1.18. With that said, I'm going to go back into the overworld, and hopefully... Fingers crossed, this sticks with it because I really want to mess around with this. Okay, so that did fix it. Okay. Yeah, as you can see, I'm completely back to normal. This looks really, really strange. Like, the portal's back to normal. The sword that I was holding before is fixed. Does it, hang on, I'm going, back to, I'm going to go back to the nether. I want to see if this will re re trigger the event. I don't think it will do that, but I want to see. No, okay. Yeah, everything's back to normal now. The portal's back, the chest's completely back. All the textures for all the entities are back. Before all this happened, I was just minding my own thing. I was just mining away, doing, as you could probably tell, trying to blast mine for an ancient array, which I got a few pieces. And I came across a lava pool, which had some ancient array behind it. And I tried going through it using the block building by strategy. But then tragedy struck, and my diamond pickaxe was accidentally thrown to lava, and I really did not like that. Even though it was it just had breaking on it, it didn't really mean much to it. And so what did I do? Well, I decided to do what I thought was right, and close out the game by like closing the tab completely without leaving the world, and see if that would potentially refresh or go back to the previous autosave, because I know that's a thing with Minecraft, and I hoped that it would revert itself back to that last autosave because it crashed. But instead, when I jumped back into the world, I got a very weird glitch with, for some, I don't even, I, I can't describe it. It's only, it seems to only be entities, because like, I'm an entity, in this case, my character's an entity. Tools and weapons are entities on the ground or in your hand. Blocks are just blocks. They are basically a solid thing in the game, and your inventory right here is just an image when you press a certain key. But still, this was a complete and out of the bloom bizarre glitch. I. Don't exactly know what happened. This happened to me in the nether. It might be recreatable. I could potentially try it again in the overworld, but I have no idea what happened. And you know what? I'm going to be back in a second, guys. I'm going to quickly get a different world up, and we're trying something out. Okay, right here we got a new world set up, and I've still got my shaders on, as you can probably tell me now. I don't know exactly know how this glitch was recreated, but I'm only going to try like a few things that I think could potentially work because it just seems outright weird. Now, for all I know, it could just be unique to the nether, but I will try that in a moment. I'm first going to do, well, just some simple testing with what I did before, and that is just, well, by closing and reopening the game using the tab tool, using the, um, the X in the corner. And so, without further ado, I think I will just close the game down in this weird fashion and just see what happens with this Optifine because it might be specifically related to Optifine. I'm just curious to see what happens. Be gone, game! And if you're curious what shaders pack I'm using, I'm using the Silders shader pack, which you can check out on the Silders, the Shelders, Silders forums. All right, Minecraft just loaded back up. We are getting back on this world and we are going to be going to town on this, well, world. Okay, that's, no, it's, no, it doesn't, I don't think that was, hmm, the texture seem to be fine, nothing's like going out of place, we don't have a black nether portal, nor do any of the items seem to be glitched out, so there might be another key factor that came to play. I only have one theory on what it could possibly be, and that's that it had something to do with the, the time that I closed the game and the way that I closed it as well. Because the way that I closed the game was that I threw the pickaxe into the lava, so let's say this is, this is a pool of lava right here. I threw a pickaxe into it and I'm like, oh crap, I did that. I paused again, I'm like, oh no, what have I done? 
So then I go up to the corner and I close the game down and then I, well, take care of that. Join back in and boom, I've got a weird glitched world, which I still understand why that's the case. I still understand that, but that's the only reason why it could have potentially been the case. I broke that by accident. Oh wait, how in the hell do I move over a like over 50 blocks just by breaking the portal. Oh, I guess we're over here, we'll have some fun with TNT. These villagers have been caught on a bad day for playing with me. Or joining my world. Technically, I joined their world, so it doesn't matter. Um, jump cut. Whoa, look at that, we've jumped forward in time, and now we're here in the future, past the entire boring process of setting the explosion. This might be considered a bit overboard, but I'm just gonna... Yeah. No comment. Like I did say, I may have gone a wee, li just a wee bit overboard with the TNT. It's just an explosion after all, but, well... E. You peon villagers and creatures better fear my ass, because with a flip of this switch, I can seal your fate in an instant. Which is what I'm going to do, and it's probably gonna go bad, so send your prayers from a PC. <laughs> Oopsies. I better hold my prayers myself because my PC is going to turn into a black hole by the end of this, so. God be with me. Oh god. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! Oh. Is that your hand on the array? Oh god. Ah! It's so glitchy. Oh my god. My PC handled that surprisingly well. That was like extremely underwhelming. Not gonna lie, but it was still nice to see a massive explosion with a massive E symbol. But anyways guys, that's gonna do it for today's short Minecraft video on this really weird and absurd glitch that I personally have never seen. I don't know if this has happened before. I've seen potential iterations of it where everything's black or some specific things are black, but not just particles. Once again, if you guys have got any clue on why this has happened, please let me know because I am clueless to how this is. I've tried to try on Google to see if there's any solution to this, but Google isn't showing me jack. And if you guys in today's video and want to see more of this kind of micro stuff, then subscribe, turn on notifications, and stay up to date with this kind of stuff that I post, along with Splatoon and Smash Bros. But anyways guys, thank you for watching today's video, and as always, yummy. I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye!